Okay, this almost looks like it could be a trail. No. Well, yeah. Some flat back in here. Now, another false alarm. Nothing wrong with uh, catching that view. I mean, I won't mind putting uh, a little fire ring down here, but, oh, boom. That's what, that's what's up. Yeah, that's what's up. I might be able to do this. I'll wake up to this in the morning. Okay, so we've, we've got something, okay? Um, no widow makers above. That's good, okay, yeah. So we've got, we've secured base, okay? We'll definitely go out and we'll look for more, but we've got a new base camp, which is good. So let's head back and grab the gear situate ourselves here and I'm gonna get something to eat now nice nice little hidden jewel that's just perfect well it was a little close to the trail but it'll do I don't think we're gonna see many people back here <laughs> we may be towards uh that first like we would but we're we're out now this is pretty remote so, not gonna go that way. There's no lakes that way, but we did come from this way. And this evening and tomorrow, uh, we'll, we'll be in search of the other lake where I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a really, really nice campsite. So, if we find that tonight, maybe we'll think, and it's really awesome, maybe we'll move out there. get something to eat now. I was out here poking around, found a nice piece of firewood. So I'm gonna go grab that. Let's do it. So just back in here. Got the old folding saw. There it is. Nice a piece, tall piece of dead standing. And it is hardwood, I'm pretty sure. Although I don't know for certain. Um, we can see here, gave it a little shave and it's, it's nice and dense, so, and it's standing. So it's gonna be some decent wood. And it's a little larger. Now, close and uh, that since it's not an official site meaning it's not on any maps or anything there's likely to be some more good wood out here so take this thing down I don't know what kind of wood it is but uh, it's good enough I mean nice hard wood I don't know if it's actually a hardwood though let me see if I can just There it went. It's nice. Pretty good sized piece.
I'm not going to cut this up yet though. Um, I might cut some of it up just to uh, st start a little fire to keep the bugs away, but I'm still going to do some more exploring, hopefully. I don't know, I'm going to relax a little bit and uh, think about what I want to do, but I'm going to think about getting a little smoke fire going to keep the bugs away and think about getting something to eat. decent. Okay, so I've got some birch bark here. Started to feather a stick. Don't even really need that. But uh, got our kindling pile over here. And we've got some bigger ones here. That's it. Goodbye, mosquitoes. Looking good. Get ready to uh, rehydrate my spaghetti here. I do not want to use a lot of water. I might just have to eat some of the other food I brought because I'm going to need that water. But maybe we'll get a little spaghetti out of it. So that's, yep, that's decent. I don't mind if the flame roars up here. Kind of got to reserve with the water. So, I don't want to get too much. Then again, I don't want to have soupy spaghetti. stuff down in the bottom with the sauce.
Well, that ought to be good. It's starting to rehydrate. Yeah. Probably could have put a little more spaghetti in there, but I know there was some. Yeah, nope. It's just about the right amount of water. I'm sure glad I did that. It's a little experiment I did. Um, made spaghetti, put it in slow on a, a spread it out in a baking pan. Uh, cracked the door on the oven and just let it dry very slowly on the lowest temperature I could get the oven. And works great. Definitely going to be doing that again and for future trips. So I uh, have to make my own fork. So I've started shaving this down. Found some harder wood too over there. Just making sure I didn't shave in my spaghetti. Yeah, this, this knife was a good buy. I'm so happy with this knife. Should have just kept the one I had the other night, but I like this wood a little better. Perfect. Hmm. That's pretty good. What a day. So, I didn't break out any trail juice yet. I'll be doing that next for sure. I may have had one little sip just to uh, feel better. Definitely got to get more wood. Mm. A little juicy. <sighs> but uh, I'll just drink that juicy water. I'm sure you can't see in there, but... Oh, didn't want to do that. I don't know if you guys have seen... I've got something in my eye. I don't know if you guys have seen my older videos where I was lugging around those two old pans. This thing is awesome. Super light, super useful. Oh, that sauce water is awesome. Bugs are killing it out here. Damn, get off. I got to get the fire going again. That hit the spot. And that view hits the spot too. Boom. 
swampy down in here. I don't want to go. The shoes, maybe I will take a dip. I think I'll just save it for tomorrow. Yeah, because the bugs will just tear me apart if I get wet. Oh, this is amazing. I just love it out here. It's so peaceful. I don't want to leave tomorrow. Oh, man. I want to bring a little inflatable raft. Ugh. Raft. Or just like a super lightweight canoe. There's no way in hell I'm dragging a canoe out here. Maybe a little mini kayak or something. Do some fishing. I'm gonna have that for a dessert in a bit. I'm gonna go hang my bag now. Oh, I gotta take the... Oh, well why don't I show you my little rig. So all this is is... I think I demoed this piece of cord before. But I've just got jam knots around my blanket. And then... <clears throat> it's just kind of a rig job. And then I just loop around that one. Oh yeah, this thing's all tore up. So I loop around this side, and I loop around this side, and it gets me through, you know? It works. And I'm super happy with my pack. I've had that bag for a long time. But uh, I'm going to pull the sleeping bag. I'm sorry, the blanket off and we'll go hang it.